Hello and welcome to Rick's Kits. A uh, quick update and some stash ads. Uh, the update is on the Corsair is I am waiting for the decals uh, to arrive. I've ordered them. Um, supposed to have been here Friday or Saturday, uh, but they're still not here. So until I get the uh, decals, then I can't do a final on the uh, Corsair just yet. Stash ads. Sorry, you having to look at a brown table, but I've got, as you know, a pair of young female kittens, and they're all over the place. So I've had to move my modelling somewhere else, so they can't get in and destroy it. So first stash ad. The one forty-eight Tamiya. Hang on, let's move this a bit. One forty-eight Royal Navy Sea Harrier FRS one from Tamiya. Uh, for me, this is uh, one of the most modern aircraft that I've picked to build at some point. Um, generally, I don't do modern aircraft, but this one's uh, fairly simple and straightforward from what I can see. Um, we've got uh, 899 Squadron on the side of there, and I'm not sure what that one is on there. Have a quick shifty uh so 899 squadron and 801 and then you've got 800 is this one hms hermes uh i'm assuming this is around the uh falklands conflict so um 899 is yeovilton and 801 is HMS Invincible, so yeah, I'm assuming that's uh, around the Falklands conflict. So that's my first stash ad. There's not many, uh, they're all aircraft, I'm finding. Uh, second one is let's go even higher again. Let's move this into place. We have a 172nd scale PBY 5A Black Cat. Uh, it's an academy kit, you see in 172nd scale. Uh, looks fairly decent, from what I can see on the uh, side of the box, so it looks like it builds well. Uh, the instructions are very simple. We have the usual gumpf. These are the only decals in the, in the pack, so it's only one aircraft. Quick shifty through, so basically final assembly is six stages. But you do get the option to have a early version or a late version of this aircraft. And uh, I think you can do wheels up or wheels down. But yeah, that's basically the entire instruction sheet. And that's just painting and decal placement. Total of six sprues and lots of detail by the look of it. So that's the second one. I did do a 148th uh, PBY Catalina a long time ago. I think it was a monogram kit. And this one is a big box. is a huge box now many of you remember a video not too long ago by me on a thunderbolt it was squirt 2 and uh saw this and i thought crikey i've got to have this kinetic model kit d filterson d republic 47d thunderbolt razorback and the scale it is in the frame down there is one twenty fourth. Um rather a fat box. You turn it on its side and you will see it takes up quite a space. So 
doing here are mismatch and squirt two and giving you an indication of the size of the box that's my hand top to bottom well not quite top but I'm not quite reaching the top give you a quick shifty inside get the lid off it Ugh. quite fit in the full frame but there you go it is hoosive and that is a box that is jam packed plastic it's got a nicely detailed engine which let me this Back on here for a sec. I'm getting hunted by the cats. Now this is the instructions for it. The uh, it's showing one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve items through section. Uh, there's the interior, the cockpit interior, quite nicely detailed. Engine, see, it is quite ex uh, quite extensive to the engine. Get all the exhausts and everything as well. Bring that there. Now the two versions to the kinetic. Uh, P47D you get this one which is obviously the Razorback and you get the bubble top version as well uh, the thing with this kit oh so the bubble top version inside it anyway got your voice of propellers OD Uh, I might make might make it squirt to one of it, build it, but I think I could do the Ohio versions. So yeah, that's it. That's it. Doing this short video, and I'll get back to you with a final on the uh, buddy build with our woods. Um, on the Corsair build uh, as soon as I got my decals and it is finished so thank you for watching I do appreciate you all this is the pain in the bum that keeps jumping on me is Lola Lola look into the camera look up see little cow sisters somewhere thank you for watching do appreciate you guys i'll see you in the next one bye for now